Raiders had the day off as they get ready for their first game of the season this Sunday. But there's still plenty of news with the silver and black. And for more on that, here's Fox 5 Sports Director Kevin Bollinger. The rosters have been cut down. The depth charts have been set. Now all eyes are on Carolina and getting out of the gate with a win. Over the weekend, the Raiders made their final roster decisions and put out who the projected starters will be for Sunday's game. There were no big surprises, although quarterback Marcus Mariota was put on injured reserve, meaning Derek Carr's backup will be Nate Peterman to start the season. On Sunday, general manager Mike Mayock spoke with the media to give his thoughts on the roster. I think one of our goals in the offseason, and we talked about it with you guys, was we had to get faster and more dynamic on both sides of the ball. And we hope we've done that. And, and obviously with no preseason games or, or any kind of inter-squad inter scrimmages with other teams, we're not going to know until next Sunday. The Raiders announced this year's captains on Tuesday. On offense, the captains are quarterback Derek Carr and center Rodney Hudson. Representing the defense are safety Eric Harris, defensive tackle Malik Collins, and linebackers Nick Kwiatkowski and Kyle Wilbur. The team also restructured the contract of linebacker Corey Littleton to give them more salary cap space. According to the salary cap website SportTrack, that leaves the Raiders with just over $9.6 million in cap space should they need to make a move on a player during the season. Kickoff for Sunday's game is set for 10 a.m. And of course, we're going to have complete coverage, including the debut of our Raiders postgame live show at 5 o'clock and Raiders game day at 1030. We hope you join us. Kevin Molina, Fox 5 News Local, Las Vegas.